All right, guys, so harvest is over. We're done. It's, it's finally, finally over. We were very excited because it's been a long year, but some of you have asked, so we're gonna give you the video. We're gonna just take you through the, the harvest equipment and we're gonna show you guys what we use. We'll start right here with this combine. Come with me. So this is the smallest of our three combines. It's also the oldest. There's a 9670. I don't know the specs on these at all. I know that they're big, they're green, they cut the corn, they cut the beans, and that's really all we need to know, right? As you can see, I mean, tires are taller than me. So this is the eight row corn head. It takes a big cut through the field. These have all LED lights. And when these things are going through the field at night, it hurts to even look at them. They're, it's so bright. This has got a regular size auger on it because it has the eight row head. This machine has a extended auger on it, as you can see, because this machine is the biggest machine that we have. This is a 770. This is our newest machine. This one makes a big cut through the field. It also has the big bend extender up on the top. It holds that extra 150 bushel because this machine has got 12 row head on it. I'll put a picture in the description. I'll put a picture in here of the machine when it's unfolded. This machine, this is the one that the boss's son drives. So this is actually the end of the head here when it unfolds. These three rows on each side, six rows unfold. As you can see though, with the folding head, it's actually narrower than the tires on the combine. So when you're going down the road, you don't have to worry about it. You fold the steps in obviously, but as you're going down the road, your head is actually as narrow as the combine. So it makes it a little bit easier to get up and down the road. So this is a 660. Uh, it's a bigger machine than the first machine that we showed you. It also has an eight row head. Believe it or not, this grain cart that I'm about to show you is the heart of our operation, as weird as that may sound, because of the technology that's in it. The technology that's in this grain cart is beyond your mind because it used to be the combine told us everything. Now the grain cart tells us everything. It tells us how much weight is in it. It tells us how much weight we're putting on the trucks. It has a flow meter, so it tells you how many bushel per acre you're getting. It tells you how many bushels per field you have. It's, uh, it's impressive. It's also absolutely humongous. This is a Demco 2200 bushel grain cart with a 22 inch auger. We load our trucks to the legal amount and we actually know exactly how much weight our trucks are getting because of the scale that's in this with the iPad that's inside the tractor. You can tell the grain cart how much weight you want to put in the truck and then the grain cart will start running and then it'll stop all on its own when it has the amount of, amount of weight that you want in the trailer. We can load a truck with anywhere from a bushel in less than three minutes.
it's pretty crazy. And then this, this is the auger that folds out. Now this machine is designed that when this auger folds out, because you can see the angle that it's at, when this auger is extended and it's completely movable, he can move it up, he can move it down, and then the end of the auger, he can rotate the snoot so he knows exactly where he's putting the corn. It also makes it a lot easier when you're trying to line up with the truck. But this auger sticks out. The driver of the tractor, he has a much better view of where the auger is on the truck. So this is, this is the John Deere 9560R. This tractor with the, the way that they, they number these tractors now, the last three number is the horsepower that the tractor has. So inside the cockpit, that's where the iPad goes. There's Miss Stevie down there. Hi guys. You have a buddy seat, which, you know, we used to call them the banker seats because the bankers wouldn't want to ride with you. And as you can see, it's, uh, it's plenty big. Everything is plenty big. This is the remote for the grain cart. Auger in, auger out, boom. The door open, closed. Left, right on the chute. I'll show you the bean heads, draper heads. And what that means is there's not the traditional sickle bar and then auger behind it. These have a belt. This is your sickle that cuts the beans. Sickle cuts the beans, then there's a belt that drives it into the feeder house. And then these rotators turn and push the beans into the head. Wow. All right, so like I said, this, this is the catwalk to the cab. There's the combine, there's the grain cart. This is the joystick, the hydrostat, all the controls on it. And there's your grain bin. That's where all the grain goes. That's where all that goes. That's the 12 row head when it's all folded up. And there's Miss Stevie. All right, so that's, uh, that's everything we use for harvest. Maybe in the spring we'll do a, a video or everything we use for planting, but it's gonna get cleaned up and it's all gonna get put away and put up against the walls. And so everybody, if you like this video, leave a comment and a like, bell notification. And next time we'll see you on the road.